Hi there, I made a code challenge for you guys. It's a very short one. So if you're interested in trying it out, here is what it's about. You have two enemies and they need to get from the beginning to the end. The one at the top goes straight and this one is more complicated. So it has multiple waypoints and it's following each one of those until it gets to the end. So here is the scene setup. You can see where the waypoints are located. There's a link in description where you can actually download the Unity package for this challenge. And it's going to include the challenge one folder, sprites and tiles. In the challenge one, you have the option of either completing the challenge using C sharp or visual scripting. And in each of these, you have a scene that you can open and it's going to look like this. So there is an enemy prefab. This is the C sharp version of it. And the only thing that you'll need to modify is the script. So challenge one script. And if we take a look right here for the enemy C sharp, it has two parameters that we can set, which is speed and an array of waypoints. So that is populated for you. And to complete the challenge, you don't have to do anything in the scene or the inspector. All you have to do is write in this challenge one C sharp script. Inside the update, you can write your code to get those enemies to travel through the waypoints. Now, the variables that you have here is speed, which is a float and transform array of waypoints. And you probably need to use a waypoint index to iterate through those waypoints. So I added that private variable for you to get you started. The challenge has seven tests. And here is the list of them. So first I check, make sure that the enemy is actually moving. Then test two checks if the enemy is moving at the right speed. And uh, the next two checks are checking for the enemy to face the direction where it's moving. Test five is checking, make sure that the top enemy reached the end of the waypoints. Test six checks for the bottom to be reached end points and test seven checks to make sure that you destroy the enemy once it gets to the end. So if you write the code and pass these tests, you will get a hundred percent score. That's the C sharp version. Now the VS, uh, the visual scripting version is exactly the same. So here is the scene. The only difference is that the enemy is actually using the script machine. And the graph is right here, challenge. So again, if you want to complete this challenge, the only thing you have to do is to modify this script or this graph. And in here, I actually added some notes that will help you to get started. So there are the variables waypoints, uh, which is a list. And I included a note here that you can use to get an item from that list. Also, if you want to retrieve the count of how many waypoints there are, there is a note of count items and to get the speed in per second. Also, there is a per second unit that you can use. So I included those if you're not familiar with uh, those nodes, the rest of the nodes mostly going to be related to transform or generic like add, multiply and if nodes. So that is the challenge. If you're interested in that, go ahead, try the challenge out if you like it or if you don't, make sure you let me know in the comments. And if there's going to be enough of you that would be interested in seeing more of this, I might create some more challenges similar to these. In a little bit, I will post solutions to these challenges for each C sharp and the visual scripting version. So if you get stuck at any point, you can take a peek at that and get yourself moving forward. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet to my channel and be sure you do that and I'll see you in the next one.